Hello friends. In this video I'll show you how to run document.net component on a Linux system. In my example this is Ubuntu version. We will believe that you have installed Visual Studio code and you have minimal knowledge of working in this system. So, let's begin. Today we will try to convert PDF to PDF-A. PDF-A is an ISO standardized version of the portable document format PDF, specialized for use in the archiving and a long-term preservation of electronic documents. Create a folder and name it PDF to PDF-A. Place in this folder any PDF file that you want to convert to PDF A format. In my example, it's a license.pdf. Launch a Visual Studio code and select the tab. Open a folder and specify the folder we created. A new project will be created in this folder and all project files will be stored inside. Next, you need to create a project. To do this, select new terminal and enter the command .NET new console. Press enter. This process is very easy and as a result you will see the message. The template console application was created successfully. Next step. You must share the PDF to PDFA.c as proj file. This file will contain all records of third-party packages that are required to run the project under Linux. Don't worry. There's dependencies are completely free and very easy to install. So, select the Go, go to File tab and enter the command to load dependencies via NuGet, NuGet add package. Enter the package name, Sautin Soft and select the latest version of Sautinsoft.document. You can see that the line has been added to our project, which confirms that you have added a new dependency. By the same rules, add the rest of dependencies system.io.packaging. System.text.encoding.codepages System.xml.xpass.xml document zkweb.system.driving
and a new transfer that dot json so we have added all the necessary dependencies and can proceed to the verification of the project debug start debugging you may receive the message required assist to build the pdf and the question add them click yes and restore object the next step is to write code directly to convert your pdf file to pdf a file add using system.io using sortinsoft.document Next, add a few lines of code. In the first, we write the code for PDF loading with parameters. Further, we indicate that we will use document component and specify paths for input PDF. We write the code for PDF saving with the parameter PDF complaints PDF A and save our new PDF file. launch our project. Depending on the size of your PDF file and the power of your computer, this process can take several seconds.
As a result, in new terminal window you will see message that build successed. Zero warning, zero error. Go to the project folder and open the resulting PDF A file. Using document.net component by Sodent Soft Company, you can easily convert any PDF, docx, RTF, HTML files using Linux, Windows, or macOS. Thank you.